Hello everybody, Golden Pony Boy here, and we are back with the next installment of our Undertale adventure. Um, I went ahead and skipped ahead to <clears throat> uh, over here where our journey shall continue. Nice cavern. Ooh, nice cave. <gasps> oh, I forget this guy's voice. Yo, are you sneaking out to see her too? That's not his voice. Awesome. She's the coolest, right? Oh, I forget his voice entirely. I want to be just like her when I... I just want to... I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> <coughs> oh, voices. Voices, voices, voices. I have water with me this time. Maybe I won't die. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Uh, oh, look. Uh, I'm going to save. Sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Save. <laughs> what? You ever seen a guy with two jobs before? I wasn't sure you had one, to be perfectly honest. Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. He wouldn't be that excited, but you know what I mean. Well, I'm going to Groovy's. Want to come? Sure. Well, he insists. I'll pry myself away from work. It looks like you're working hard there, buddy. Who are you? I know shortcut. I'm fairly certain we just teleported. That's shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hey, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans. Were you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? No. I haven't had breakfast in at least an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Oh, Sans. Hey, be comfy. Whoops. Watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Sands. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? Mmm, fries or a burger? I oh, burger. Hey, this sounds pretty good. Grillies will have a double order of burg. Are you combing your skull? So, what do you think? For my brother. I can't lie. The guy's pretty cool. Of course he's cool. It'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. <clears throat> Ooh, I like these baggers. Here comes the grub. Um, not really in the mood for ketchup. Or for me. And he just downed that entire thing of ketchup. <coughs> anyway, cool or not cool, you have to agree, Papyrus tries really hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged him, and begged him to let him be in it. His voice keeps fluctuating, I'm sorry. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up to, and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh, still in progress. Still a work in progress. Oh yeah, I want to ask you something. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? I've heard of a couple. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Sans, is it you? Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe it let you pull me away from work that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? 
Push it. What? No, 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 no. Just kidding. Ruby, put it on my tab. <coughs> By the way, I was gonna say something, but I forgot. Thanks, Sansy. All right. Well, we should take us back, right? Nah. I'll be right back. <laughs>